Here's an all-time stat from the record books. 5.7 yards per carry, career average, a number that tops any running back ever. Somebody dominated his sport like that and was responsible for breaking this modern day color barrier. Shouldn't his name be etched in the history books too? History shows, not when it comes to football. The beast behind that record is Marion Motley. The man whose historical impact on society is hidden behind the skeletons in pro football's jam packed closet. See, seven months before Jackie changed the country by signing in Brooklyn, Motley broke through the color lines with the Browns. But we don't hear much about that today. Certainly not at the frequency Marion received death threats back in 46 or slurs. There were lots of those. Gator bait is the only one I'll repeat. Hateful opponents would try to break his fingers too, stomping on his hands with cleats, refs turned a blind eye. Motley did it, and proceeded to break tackle after tackle after tackle until the slurs turned to all. His fingers never got broken, but records smashed. How's this one? October 1950. The big fella shredded the Steelers, y'all. 188 yards, 11 carries. That's over 17 yards of run. A single game record that stood for 52 years. Earning all that hardware was hard on the knees. His body was done, but his mind was far from it. Mary Motley wanted to coach. He asked his former coach, Paul Brown, for a gig, and Brown recommended the steel mill, then immediately hired this guy. He tried again and again, same result. He questioned the league's interest in hiring black coaches. By the way, how's that going today? Maybe having the audacity to call out the league back then is why silence surrounds his true impact on the game today. But we're silent no more. Remember the four, the forgotten four.